Well, hello everyone. Today I'm out here cutting up some oil field pipe. These are used drill stem. These are two and three eighths inch pipe, but you know, this works for pretty much any kind of pipe that you have the right template for. But when I'm over here making corner braces, which I'm, I'm putting up right here, we're putting some corners before you weld them up. You want to make saddle cuts. Uh, some people call them coping or cope the, the pipe. Um, I just call them saddles. So here's some saddle cuts, as you can see. They're not 100% perfect because I'm usually Russian, but you can cut a real nice perfect one using these templates I'm going to show you. So I have this set here that I, I picked this up off Amazon. comes in a little container like this. Warning, makes job easier. And they do. Uh, I don't have to guess at these. And here's a little 4-in-1 Pipe Pro, whatever that is. So anyways, this kit comes. This one is for 2 and 7 8 this one's for two and three eighths, and this is for one and seven eighths. So this is your most common pipe you're typically running into for just fence pipe and so forth. But uh, today I'm using this pipe, so I'm gonna put these other two templates up. And we're gonna talk about this template here. First thing I do is I just put the template over the pipe. They're magnetic, so when you close them, they uh, stick to the pipe well. But I try not to waste much pipe, so I get real close to the edge. And then I just come in here and I make my marks. Make the mark from the template. You do this on both sides. I do the, the top part right here is for a good saddle cut. And then you've got these other cuts. Uh, and they'll tell you right on the template, like this is a 45 degree cut. If you want to do it, this is 22.5. All right, so I removed the template. So now you can see here where I've got this mark. I just used a black pencil and marked it. And now I'm going to get the bandsaw and chop that off. So here's a little trick that I do if, if the saddle doesn't come out perfect, like this one wasn't cut at the perfect angle. Plus this probably needs to be cut off a little bit and it's gonna saddle better. If you want to make this hole here saddle better on your vertical pole, you can get your grinder and make a little slice in this edge here on both sides, which then gives it just a little bit of space for this to bend. And then you can hammer in, uh, or what I do, I always do a bind like this on my uh, corners so that wire holds them in and it keeps these in a, a good place for me to weld them but when i do that i can tighten it up a little bit more and it will actually flare these edges out for this one like i said the saddle is not the perfect cut but i also have this little here so i can really just nip this little edge off and it'll probably saddle just fine well if this video was helpful please give me a thumbs up uh, subscribe to the channel that's that red button right below the video please hit subscribe it's absolutely free it just helps me out with the channel and thank you for watching the video. I'll see y'all again soon.